doing? I'm fixing the businessman's leg. No, he got he had a, met with a slight accident with the, the train wagon. That was a well. I I, I I saw this train wagon over there. And I thought, well, what's that going to do? And then uh, I was looking at some other exhibits, and I came back, and it was gone. And I thought, what? The train wagon's moved. I, I just couldn't believe it, you know. The next thing, I saw this one fly up in the air, minus his foot. And I thought, oh no. Uh, <laughs> and there. Uh, you know, because they, like all trains, you can't steer them. You can only go in one direction. So they didn't have a lot of choice. But uh, I'll find a way of sabotaging their wagon tonight. I'll get the businessmen to kick it as it goes past. I kind of feel a kind of sympathy for them. You know, they got their little case and their grey suits. And this one is hanging off his case. They have sensors in their legs and feet and uh, trigger off drum beats because as they, as they jostle, they make different, be different beats in all their limbs. I just, I just like them, I like the uniform. There's lots of different types of uniform. You know, every fashion is a kind of uniform. And a uniform implies a kind of army. They kind of joined this army that they don't really want to be in. No electrics, they, they switch themselves. Uh, I've started making autonomous pieces again because that way I get something back from them. You know, I. I, I I've, I've never really liked building things that I can predict. So I want it to do something that gives me back something new, you know, so uh, I'll try and make things autonomous so they'll have some degree of switching themselves. Trigger their own air valves. Whoops, nice. So it's air pressure. Yeah, of course, yeah. Air, air is providing the energy, but then switching it. I don't want to use. Um, don't want to use control equipment really. I'd like to get down to something very simple, so that it triggers itself by its own swinging, you know, its own oscillation. And that way, you can get things to move quite wildly because they move like they want to, and then. Uh, you can get surprised by what they do. You know, everything is always handed to everyone on a plate. You know, you end up with a computer program that does that. And, you know, one thinks one is creating by pressing a few buttons. So well, it doesn't work like that. You're only creating by misusing something, really. But, you know, taking it and doing something else with it. I seem to find myself here every year. So, I'm really glad, you know, yeah. I really like coming here. It's just the most amazing opportunity. But one day I have to bring something more substantial. <laughs> <laughs> I was a bit sort of embarrassed by my contributions. <laughs> Usually very scruffy and sort of last minute. <laughs> I only have one minute and then the air goes out again. Hey, Bastian. Hey. We also yeah, like to ask you a couple question. of questions. I'll we'll try. Answer some questions, you. Okay, okay. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Who are you? Aren't all about Why? How? Why? And, Why? <laughs> and, and how? And yeah, exa exactly. Yeah, Why? well, because. <laughs> I mean, why not? I mean, what else? <laughs> 